Hi guys, we are here in Walmart. I'm gonna bring you with me. Oh my God, this sun. I'll go and bring you with me to Walmart and let's cross our finger that their plants is not dead. Okay, let's go. I don't know if it's all alive. So it's 3.48, all of these groups here from um, different kind of company like Element, Silver Coral. It not, looks not happy. <laughs> it looks not happy. Okay, um, cane plant. That's the name, Janet Craig. You know, I always wonder what's the history about this plant, why it's called Janet Craig. It's the name of a lady. So maybe she is the one who named this plant. Look at this one. All of these are marble queen. They have a lot. This one looks really nice, huh? So for this one, let's see how much. Huh, it does, oh, <laughs> I already show you the price. <laughs> $3.48. So this one doesn't look good, but if you have a green thumb, you can revive it, right? That's the Rosy Maiden Hair Burn. You know, I like this one. It looks pretty good. Even this one here, the Marble Queen, it's pretty variegated. Look at that. Nerve plant, a red nerve plant. If you can barely hear me, uh, I'm wearing a mask. So be nice if you cannot hear me okay i'm trying to talk loud so this is the white variegated kind of nerve plant see white and and this is the red one ruby red Aww. ruby red is so healthy they have a lot of wandering dew. Why they call it inch plant here? It's actually wandering dew. Let's go over here. They still have the strawberry begonia. For I don't know how much. This is not the three dollars one. I think this is the 17 bucks. And they have these group plants. Some of it got frozen. I'm glad that they put it in here. Let's go on the back here. So they have a lot of starting crouton for the three dollars and uh, forty-eight cents. They have umbrella plants. Same price. They have a lot of dracenia. Of course, they still call it Sensiberia, which is fine to me. This one is so difficult to kill, so most of them are still alive here. Most of these umbrella plants is also alive, but look at the Brazil photos. It's dead. Oh, Brazil just died. And of course, Cebu Potos is dead. Oh, so bad. Some nerd plant is dead also. Okay, this is the um this is Napilodendrum. This is a Potos, um neon potos. 
it still look like it's gonna make it but I don't think I'm gonna buy it for 17 bucks what do you think guys are you gonna buy it for 17 bucks there still fine but almost dead same thing with the Brazil here Oh, you did? Yeah, I did that two times during the years that I was here doing that toy department. Oh, wow. Oh, this is where they put them. Now, are these real? On this aisle, there's still some alive plants, but some of them are dead. All right, let's grab this one. So, creeping pigs. I think these ones are for three bucks. I'm they don't have a they don't have a price. Look at this one. All of them are starting plants. Like this, you can see the this is Ariella, Arella Gold Crest, False Arella looks good uh huh i'm glad they put this in here because if they put it outside there it's dead but most of the ones here on the bag it's pretty dead a lot of um croutons and all of this by the way guys it, the purple passion is dead all of these are alive let's go and check out the top here okay the ferns is still alive let's see the name of it tricolor break fern for three bucks is fine huh if you still want to have some little nice plant this one is alive there umbrella plants with a yellow variegation and oh that one is dead oh it's so sad and all of the friends here are frozen dead wow so that's it what walmart has you know by the grocery they have this fresh rosemary that you can put in your little pot in the kitchen let's smell it there's me oh it smells so good can you see me on the reflection that smells so good even i am wearing a even i'm wearing a mask And they even have parsley. I don't know how much. They don't have any prices. Let's see here. Oh, look at that. This is mint. Let's arrange it. I like the um, the rosemary. Okay, guys, we are in Home Depot. You know, sometimes I put my camera in somewhere that where the sun is glowing on my face nicely because we don't want people to see my lines, right? <laughs> All right, guys, let's not talk about uh, lines on the face. We're gonna go to Home Depot and check it out. I'll see you with me. I will see you. I'll see you in Home Depot. Don't make fun of my grammar. Hey, okay, let's go to here in Home Depot. My God, so much plant, guys. Plants. Holy gamoli. So, th this is like the banana one. You know what is it? It's a bird of paradise. How much? There is a rest. 
There. 20 bucks. It's so pretty. And then bromelad. I'm a bromelad addict. I still want to have these kinds of bromelad. For 15 bucks. You know, I want this one because it looks so exotic. And then I want it to put with this one. Wouldn't they go together like uh, the pink one and the orange one? Wow. Look at that. Look at that. And this one looks very exotic. For that one, it's still the same, 15 bucks. Let's arrange it. I don't want to hurt them, guys. I never like to hurt the plants. So, if you see me arranging them, I'm not hurting them, right? So, they have a lot of fiddly pigs for... It doesn't have a price right now. They always have fiddly pigs. I accidentally killed mine. I did not kill it, but it just died. So I don't know if I'm gonna get more fiddly pig. They're not happy in my house because my house is a little bit cold. So they have different kinds of cane plants here. And then um peace lily and then bromelad again and then huge peace lily look at these huge peace lily ones i want to see how much wow that is 60 dollars and then some palms I'm gonna check how much it is, okay? For this is 60 bucks. So, as I have said, in Asia, we have so much of this. All right, should we, I want you to make a decision here. Should we go here or should we go over there? I don't hear any boat, so <laughs> I'll just go over here. Oh, they have a starter one for for three dollars and thirty three cents. And a flower pot. I like this one. Choose your color. For this is for seven bucks. Look at this pink one. Oh, with a pink powdery thing. Wow. That one, the orange, it's a little bit dead. And then of course bromeland. A lot of palms. This is as almost tall as me. Really big palms. And um, they have a lot of succulents. You know, last time I said... Wait a minute. Look at these money plants. For 40 bucks. With a basket. You know, last time I said, let's go to the real plants. Guys... I did not say that succulent is not a real plant. Sometimes I use English more direct words. Please understand me. Of course, succulents are real plant. Look at this one. 
isn't this so pretty it looks like a cabbage i want to eat it with a chicken soup <laughs> look at this one has a lot of babies So for this little pot is about five bucks. You know guys, I have like this. Here's the name. Se Semper Vivium. Their flower is so pretty. The most prettiest thing I ever seen. I think I post it on my uh long time ago I posted on my Instagram the flower of this it's like a peachy color okay let's take a look here on the top all of those snake plants are 10 bucks and then this hanging basket is for 30 bucks golden photos golden photos so all of these here are 50% off really but it's dead why they make it 50% off and then all of it are dead? I'm still looking for a nice one. Well, I can't find anything. Okay, for 10 bucks, they have some... Birkin. I have Birkin also. When I say I have Birkin, I'm not bragging. I'm just saying <laughs> I have these plants. You know, some people say that it's so easy to take care of this plant, but mine is almost not happy where I put it. You know, this is a moonshine. Wow, it has so much babies. How much is Mr. Moonshine? There's no price. Uh, and then Peperomia Emerald. The green emerald. What? 10 bucks. And then this is Syngonium Holy Blanco for 10 bucks. Holy Gamoli. I should um, make a thumbnail. I think I like this one. Let's go to the other side over there. I think it looks nicer over there. Okay, some little um, ferns for the same amount of money, guys. It's healthy. And then, of course, a lot of uh, moonshine. Look at this one. Isn't it so nice? I do not have it. I want to buy all of this one, but you know it's so expensive. 25 bucks. Should I get it? I should get it, huh? Every time I, I try to talk on the phone, people are like looking at me, what I'm doing. Look at that! It's bromeliad again! This is more different. 
How much? There's no price. It comes like this in a basket. I'm sure this is expensive. Let's find a basket. Oh my god, look at this. An orange one. Wow, I thought this one was beautiful. And uh, let's see. 30 bucks. Wow. Look at the pink one. I always like the one that looks exotic. Look at the pink one. That one is something else, huh? Wow. So Dracenia, Dracenia Sunrise is 25 bucks. And all of those are golden photos. They have a lot of orchids. This is the smaller orchid. For 15 bucks. 15 bucks. <laughs> 15 bucks. Wow. Look at the pot. There's a little small pot here. And a little bit medium and a medium oh wow i like this one wow 15 15 and 12. and then bigger pots and they have their price that's expensive huh this is all white pots here. Pots, 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 pots. I love pots because it makes us so happy. <laughs> Who doesn't like pots? Such a kill joy. <laughs> you know what I mean? Look at that. Look at the plants here, it's all dead. See the peace lily? They're dead. Um, and all of these pots here are, uh, plants here are 25 bucks. Same thing there. And then all of those are 20 bucks, the hanging plants. Oh, uh, you know what? Oh, the m most prettiest thing I see. What is this? It's a smaller version of Bird of Paradise? What? Let's check it out. What's the name? Wow, I never seen a small version of Bird of Paradise. Have you guys? See? Don't say that it's a new plant that I'm just... It's just a baby par bird of paradise. But it's so cute in this pot. This is about $25. Nice, huh? Of course, everything is nice here. Look at that. There. And this one, see, 25 bucks. And CC plants. Just a regular CC. I never seen uh, that dark uh, Ray-Ban CC. Never. And then some Aglionimas. And also over here. This is a garden succulent. 
after some variety of different kinds of, of succulent this is about uh, 23 bucks same thing here oh I like this one look at this one cactus you know I was talking to my friend Eileen that when she see a flower on a cactus like this this kinds of flower it that is not a real flower because ow it was poking me um look at that they put fake flower I really thought long time ago that was a real flower I was laughing at her because she was uh, buying these kinds of cactus and she is choosing different kinds of fake flower <laughs> when I told her that it was fake she was actually surprised wow this one is a nice cactus this is a variegated one it's like a cow tongue small version cactus but it's white white kind of cactus okay guys thank you for watching today i just brought you inside home depot uh i did not go to lowe's because the video will be really long and then you know when the video is really long some friends of mine is telling me that it's really long so um, I will put a clip here that I, pro 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 I propagate my whale fin. You know, I have to hold my, let me just put it there because we still have a little sun. I need to uh, show you some technique of mine, how to propagate uh, uh, Dracenia or Sensiberia. Let me just say it again. I love to call it in Siberia so um, if you have some dracenias you guys will know a little bit of technique how I do it um, somebody is watching me on front of my car there and he's just standing there so it's kind of weird so I will just <laughs> I'll just go and say goodbye for now and then uh, we'll talk about propagation on my next video I'm just gonna go and put the clip on this video I have to go now, okay? I'll see you guys next time. Bye for now. Guys, uh, I'm uh, going to propagate my whale fin. This is about two feet of whale fin. This is the two babies. It's really big, huh? And then this is the mommy plant. So if I can put it over here like that, you can see how high is my whale fin. Yeah, it's about two feet um, I saw mommy today it has this yellowy thing on the tip so I cut it I cut part of mommy over here <laughs> so you know and then I just cut it like that so when you cut um, Dracenia the new name of Sensiberia if you cut a whale fin, uh, Sensiberia, guys, you can just go and cut on the end here. Really go really back there. And then uh, leave it for maybe an hour. Just leave it on the counter anywhere you can just leave it like that. So that when you put it in the water, it will not rot. So just leave it to dry a little bit here don't put it right away on the water uh, I found that technique working so it won't uh, gonna rot your um, sensibiria look at this one here this is another sensibiria that I'm propagating I just put it there in the water so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut the other parts here um, so when you cut something like this, you just go and sharpen your knife, okay? You don't need a surgical blade for this. This is not a surgery, brain surgery. 
so you just cut really back here there you go and then leave it that's mommy right now and then hopefully the all of this will grow higher so this is the mommy and then this is the baby whale fin okay, okay time to propagate the whale fin let's just cut it cut it from the mother plant cut here Just like that and then put it in the water leave it out for the water outside the water for now um, wait for a few minutes an hour maybe not few minutes uh, this one we don't need to cut 